What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We are going to... We're going to play some... Vintage Cube. Mystic Confluence seems just wonderful. Zayamar, I think you mentioned this draft a couple times, but, like... I tend not to... Like, unless people, like, donate for steps, I really rather not do steps, because, like, I have to pay for the draft, and usually if you're doing a step, like, you're not going to win anything. <laughs> you know, like, it's, it's very rare that, like, a stipulation goes so well that you, you actually, like, get super rewarded for it you know <sighs> I don't know man Mr. Confluence it's one of these two for sure these are easily the two most powerful dudes I think Dak is oh god yeah if we have a really good deck we can win and if we have an accidental pile we win that's pretty much it though alright we'll take Dak dang it Dang it. I like Time Warp and I like Control Magic. I like Time Warp. <laughs> you are Frank and we follow because I like your way of understanding the game and because you're a person who talks about respect and important things. I think this journey is helped. Dude, Dragon Crocodile, that is like the best compliment you could give me. I really appreciate you saying so. I try to be super welcoming to everyone as long as you're not kind of, kind of mean or kind of a jerk. In which case I'll be like, hey, stop being a jerk. And I'll even, like, I'll, I'll try to give you a little chance. Oh, Nifty Chris, thanks so much. 500 draft a good 3-0 deck stipulation. Okay, I'm going to do it, Chris. I'm going to do it. I don't even know what that emote is. Oh, that's the old nut crap. Oh, I like, oh, I like through the breach. Oh, now we're doing it. Oh, yeah. Now we have a little bit of a plan here. Oh, I like a Jace. Hmm. 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 I don't think we're storming. I don't think we need to go into third color. I think we just take this Jace because he's very good. It's true. He invited me into his house to queue because I was a nice person. Joke's on him. It was all clear. Joke's on me because you don't even like Magic the Gathering. That's why the joke's on me. Got him. I guess I didn't really get him. That doesn't really seem like a good got him. Good got him. I'm going to take this Chandra Torture Defiance. I like all of the cards we have so far. Ooh, including this Brazen Borrower. Okay. Hey, I love Magic the Gathering. I don't believe that. I don't believe that for a second. I used to comment many of the YouTube videos in which you talked about the community and the way that people behave. Also about that it's not necessary to trash. It's not. It's totally not. Like, if you like something, that's cool. You can like that. It's a great game that people should continue to buy cards to build decks from great places like cool stuff in cardkingdom.com. <laughs> Chris, I appreciate that you not only plugged your your work but but my mine as well. So class act, class act, Chris. Nifty Chris, class act. Did you guys know Chris's last name was Murderer? It's his name is Chris Murderer. Isn't that weird? Oh, so I got some. I got a YouTube comment. Hilariously enough, guys, I want you to listen to this this YouTube comment. It says, "And let me see what you guys think." Oh, I'm gonna take this Badlands just in case. It's the comment is, "Your voice puts me to sleep. Is that weird? I never thought hearing a grown man cube draft would be effective sleep aid. 2020 is strange already." And then someone else said. Been on that plan for years. Honestly, it makes it hard to stay awake when I want to watch sometimes. And I was like, man, maybe I need to get into the ASMR business. Maybe I'm just in the wrong line of work. Um, Could be Desperate Ritual. We played a ritual before when we had Through the Breach. <laughs> Thank you. Rat drink. Oh, Jesus. I'm sending that to Mike right now, just so you guys know. That's... I don't know who that is, but someone made that account. And that's hilarious. Wow, you guys are amazing. 
Wow. Wow. <laughs> I can't. Oh, Lord. That's amazing. Red Train Conductor, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Oh, man, first time catching live stream. That doesn't seem... That doesn't seem correct at all. Oh, boy. I guess we'll take Grim Lava Mancer here. Oh, wow, Thousand Year Storm came back, said a thing in the ice. I'm going to take the thing in the ice. What if we have a thing in the ice in play, and then we cast through the breach, and it triggers this, so that we put, like, Emrakul into play, and then it just bounces Emrakul? That would suck, wouldn't it? I still think it's correct. Oh, Imperial Recruiter? Okay. All right. Our deck seems okay. Oh man, Rad Train Conductor, I appreciate you, dude. Thank you for coming from YouTube. That is awesome. That is my favorite thing. Okay. I mean, I guess Time Warp and Time Walk are both pretty good. Especially when we have two Planeswalkers so far. So we're setting ourselves up with Imperial Recruiter to be like... Splinter Twin, and we're also setting us up for Through La Breach. I've been watching and falling asleep to your YouTube videos for almost two years now. It's no joke. Oh my god. Oh my god. You guys are seriously making me wonder if, like, I have a, a much larger audience in the ASMR community. Goblin Guide for Mike's birthday. What? Why would we take Goblin Guide for Mike's birthday, though? Coincidence, I've been talking, uh, watching him in person, talking in person and falling asleep. Wow. Wow. That's true. Chris does, uh, that's because, I mean, but to be fair, Chris has narcolepsy, guys. Um, no, no, don't, please don't make fun of Nifty Chris in the chat, though, because his narcolepsy is a serious issue. I mean, there'd be times where I would be hanging out with Chris and he would actually just fall asleep at the table and all of us, whoever was there, would have to, like, go into the other room and just let him sleep because he's, like, you know. You just let it, you gotta let him be. You gotta let him, you gotta let it run its course. You know what I mean? I kind of like Thran Dynamo here, but then like, if any one of these four comes back, I'll be fine with it. Low grade Narcolepse. <laughs> oh, Deceiver Exarch. Okay. That's a dude. Now we're getting close. We're getting close, guys. I think Michael B. just got home. Oh, Preordain? That seems like a late Preordain. Thank you. But I'll take it. Good girl, Jared. Thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. High grade narcolepsy. What's the difference between low grade and high grade narcolepsy? I don't even understand. I have no idea if Frank is being serious. I was not. Chris does not suffer from narcolepsy. That I know of. That I know of. Hmm. I like a remand. I'd really like a, a volcanic or a... What's the other one? Steam vents. What's the Twitch account of Mike B? Mike B does not have a Twitch account. Low grade Narclips equals an awesome power. High grade Narclips is something people say when they... <laughs> God damn. Jesus. Chris, I have a family, you know. I'm going to take Remand here. I, I also like Ember's Shieldbreaker, but... Oh, Blightsteel? Is Blightsteel good enough for Through the Breach? Yes, because we could also get a Tinker. But we could also take Muldrifter. Like, they don't have a creature, right? Maybe all my friends are narcoleptic because my voice is just so... So rich and buttery. So that all my friends just fall asleep in my presence. I think it's Muldrifter. I don't think we're... Like, we have no artifacts for Tinker, so I don't think we're tinkering... I'm really just holding out for... Oh, well. All right. We're really just holding out for Emrakul. I don't know if we'll get an Emrakul. Impulse? Sure. Because maybe we're also a thing in the ice deck. Now they have Preordain, Impulse, Time Walk, Remand. <coughs> Brazen Bar was also a sweet a sweet play. So we can take Ancient Grudge or Hydroid Crasses. Both are good if we get a, a green land to splash. I'm going to take the Ancient Grudge because I think it's just a little bit better. That's true, we're going to steal an artifact, then we're going to tinker away their artifact. Michael B! I'll take this. I don't know why. 
I think it's better than anything else. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay, I don't think it's great, but I mean, again, it's it goes with our impl or our thing in the ice plan. Rakdos's return could be okay. We have a Badlands. Oh wow, Shieldbreaker came back. My only loss of the draft tonight was the round where I got franked. Yeah, Thwalk apparently drew two lands in game one and like ten lands in game two. Twelve lands, eleven lands. That's even not bad. All our, all these picks are pretty good. We also low-key have a decent, like, mono red deck here. Not yet, but we could. Grim Monolith seems great. That's a turn three through the breach. Kind of. I mean, all these things, like, help us play Treasure Cruise earlier, which is really important. <sighs> okay, we're looking... Oh, wow, someone passed a Soul Ring? What was in this pack, my dude? Yeah, we're definitely taking that. So far, we don't have Kiki Jiki, and we don't have Through the Breach, so. Wow. Thanks, my dude. I think something will also come back from there. Um, excuse me. I mean, maybe Black Lotus, maybe. But even, even I don't even think that is better, per se. Do I, well, Venser, right? Venser's better than Electromancer. And Electromancer's probably going to come back, whereas Venser probably won't. Oh, Roofstock White with the bits! All these cry oh, cryptic command. Fuck. I mean, we're just we just have a really sweet control deck at this point, right? I mean, it's not Fire Blast, not Spell Pierce. I'm definitely just taking cryptic command here. I mean, let's put all the cards that aren't going to do anything over here, right? <laughs> Thank you. Doomsday. Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. They passed soaring for the rats in that pack. That makes sense. I mean, sometimes you just got to get on the rat train, you know. I ain't mad at you. Shaboopy, shaboopy, my gon' be all day. Our deck is not coming together, guys. We totally whiffed on, like, on both Through the Breach and on Splinter Twin. Blah. I think we just take Stomping Ground because we have an Ancient Grudge. I don't care about Eidolon or Duretti. I mean, it's... I mean, we could splash it off Badlands, but, like, that doesn't feel great. I think Consecrated Sphinx is actually better for us. I think if we had Pestermite and if we had the Zealous Conscripts from the first pack, we'd probably take the the other thing. But since we don't... Oh, we also have Desperate Ritual, which we can cut, which is pretty trash. And Imperial Recruiter. So now I actually feel like we freed up some slots. I like Rekindled Phoenix a lot. If you're asking me what kind of man I am... I'm always going to be the, the the Consecrated Sphinx type of man. Wow, Sneak Attack would be great if we had... We have Through the Breach and Sneak Attack and literally nothing to to do with those guys. Yeah, I'll take you. You're fine. Dark Dwellers with Time Walk? Oh, that's pretty good. The problem is we only have Time Walk, but I still think it's worth it. Oh, we have Light at the Stage. Yeah, I guess it's fine. Electromancer came back. Oh, I actually like Season Pyromancer here a lot. Okay, so we have some cuts to make. We have no fixing mana whatsoever when we have Cryptic Command. I might just cut Cryptic Command. It feels terrible, but... Like we saw...
Put that guy back. Yeah, let's cut Cryptic Command. Got three more cards. Jeez. We'll put, we'll put the Shield Breaker in the sideboard because we already have deck. I don't actually think we need Treasure Cruise here. I don't also think we need Thran Dynamo. We have Grim Monolith and Sol Ring. This is probably the deck here. Nine, eight. I think we actually want... I think we actually have more red red needs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Eh, we don't, but we have more double red cards, which is my concern. Like, we don't need it. This is not going to be double red until turn whenever we cast it. So the, the soonest double red we have is 1 on 4 here, but then we have 4 mana, 4 mana, 4 mana, 4 mana, 4 mana, or 3 mana. So I think we actually do want one more red. This is what 600 franc points look like. Well, now I know. All right. Is this right? We have Deceiver Exarch. We have Riffling Cloudskate here. Do we care about Dark Dwellers? Yeah, we still want 17 lands. We want to hit all of our lands. Plus, we have a lot of filtering. We have Jace, Remand, Impulse, Preordain. I wonder if Dire Fleet's just better than Dark Dwellers. Dark Dwellers getting back Time Walk. We only have two hits. We have Light of the Stage and Time Walk. I don't actually think we want Dark Dwellers. I think we might even rather just have Siege Gang. Siege Gang's just a solid body. Recruiter gets Muldrifter, Venser, Seasoned Pyromancer. Is it Toughness? It's got to be Power, right? And the white one's Toughness, right? This is Power? Yeah. So it gets Exarch. Riftwing, Jace, and Thing in the Ice. It's actually not bad. I'm actually going to cut light up the stage for Recruiter. I guess I'll wait to submit because Moochel's coming in right now, so. It's Moochel. Coming on down to Rat Train. Here he comes down to rat train. Uh, we added Siege Gang because I like having... I like having a Siege Gang with Recruiter because we can just go get a Siege Gang. This is our deck. We like third pick to through the breach, but it never came together. Breardane, Soul Ring, Grimmy, Cl Cloud Skatey, Time Walk, Ming Ash, Remand, Jace, Impulse... This deck looks real good. Yeah, I think it's sweet. And then we have Through the Breach in the sideboard. How's the mana? It's literally just mountains and plains, mountains and islands. Could be better. <laughs> I mean, when you two colors. I guess we also, we saw Wandering from in like pack one, but like we didn't see Spire Bluff Canal so or... Just eight, eight. No, it's eight, nine. Oh, yeah, seven. Oh, wow, look at all these, look at all these happy birthdays. I didn't even start this, man. I didn't say a thing about your birthday. Just so you know, You man. don't have to. They know. You originally started, though, so it's ultimately your fault. Right, but, like, sometimes, like, I don't even mention it, and they know. They're like, dude, it's your birthday today. I had a quick dinner so I could get here faster. What was your birthday dinner? <clears throat> it was just, like, like almost a pound of ham. Just to confirm, I asked what his birthday dinner was, and then he answered, so he confirmed that it <laughs> is his birthday. <laughs> that is a confirmation. I had some chili I'd heat it up, but that would have taken more time, and I was just like, eh. I'll just keto tonight. I'll just eat all this ham. <coughs> Are you ready? Oh, yeah. This is a keep if I've ever seen one. Have you ever seen one? Yeah. I saw one once, too, man. It was pretty sweet. Going on down to Rat Train. So we draw another blue, this is like a turn three Grimmy. There we go. Grimmy? You mean Consecrated Sphinx? Yeah. Oh, uh, well, I think I actually right? want both of these. Yeah. yeah. Both of these are fine. <coughs> Michael's going down to Rat Train. This is a turn three Consecrated Sphinx. Gosh dang. Was the ham sliced or just a ham hawk? Just a big hawk. Oh, it was, it was sliced ham. It was like lunch meat. Pretty good though. I mean, it's ham. So it's oh, not look, they, great, think they think they're special. 
Oh wow, I can steal it. I guess they could tap it though. That would be that'd be worse for us, right? Because then we're just like stealing it. Maybe it's not. It's just an. Oh fuck. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Buddy, I have a family, you know. I mean, that's good, but <clears throat> it's good. Oh dear God. Now oh, what a combo turn. Fiery Confluence would be supremely good. <laughs> Just do it for three and like nuke their board. Yeah, and I hope they like, and then they have no lands. Well, they're playing like they have six mana, monoish green, seven mana, or nine mana. Okay, Venser. A lot of mana. I don't even know. Eight mana if they play. Oh, fours, we get the right? time walk too. <clears throat> One, two, three, four. Garrick. Untap. Mega Beast. I mean, four block, four sixes still block those pretty well. Okay, well, they have one card in hand, so they have. I guess if it's Crater Hoof, we're in trouble. But I mean, we're just dead to that. But coming on down the rat train. I'm gonna get rid of Rook here. Oh no, I'm getting rid of Nissa. Oh, double. Well, they can block. How? Birds. Stupid bird! That's alright, we can kill Grook <clears throat> next turn. <clears throat> Dang, I'm really looking for the. for the thing, you know? You know what I'm saying? I would kill Garuk and leave a Venser. Not in case they do have Crater because it's the last card. No, I think I'm going to bounce the Nissa with Riftwing Cloudscape and kill the Garrick. Because then they... Okay too. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. They don't even have mana to, for... for What's his name anymore after that? Well, let's actually draw and see if we hit a... Okay. I'm going to get rid of Recruiter. I don't care about you. Going on down to Rat Train. I tried to buy a small ham to cook my crock pot and they wanted twice per pound as a regular size ham. That's weird. Oh, I'm going to draw two. That's a chicken. Look at all those chickens. Did you look at them? Did they untap this? No. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, they, they, made, they did that thing. <clears throat> well, that's a lot of damage. So, all right. Well, I don't know how we deal with all these things. We'll try. I try to say goodbye and I choke. Try to make I'll be and I stumble. I mean, we get to flashback time walk, so. How much can we deal? 4, 8, 12. We can deal 12 damage right here. Wait, we just win. Yeah, we attack for 4, and then we attack for 4, and then we attack for... No, we play this guy this turn. <clears throat> so we flashback time walk. Mm -hmm. Play the chicken. Yeah, 4, 8, 8. Yeah. Taking so many turns. <clears throat> Moving on down the red train. Yep, and they did. <laughs> oh boy. Where's my friggin' fiery confluence? There's a splinter twin. Splinter twin, splinter twin, nothing but a splinter twin. What do you see? One artifact? We saw Mana Vault? Yes. Might still be worth Shield Breaker. I don't know. I wouldn't have a Dak. Although Dak is usually awkward against that because they use it. So it's actually not that great. Still deny. Denies them the mana. I don't know, man. I think we just leave it as is for now. I think our deck is great, yeah. 
Also, I would not get a, rid of Recruiter in the future because, like, they're kind of fast, so we might need an out to, like, win fast. An out to win fast? <clears throat> mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, here we go. What do we pitch? Mall Drifter. Really? I want to pitch Bird. Yeah, but Chicken. I got two, three, four right now. Like, I'd rather have something I can play on four. Besides, like, Jace is going to let us see a bunch of cards, so I'm not really super concerned with, like, okay. cycling a Mall Drifter. Nothing but a shot of dreams. Shot of dreams. Oh, they went to five on the play? Oh, boy. Splinter Twin. Oh, that's good. That's what Father likes. What was that? What, what did you tell me the other day about that saying, Michael? No, that I was singing it to myself. Yeah, he was like, that's what... Well, you were just saying that's what Father likes to yourself? Yeah. I was singing like, that's what Father likes. Wow. <clears throat> What are your feelings on cheese? I fucking love it. The good cheese. And they have cradle. The That's bad cheese. Kurt, when do those nugs get in here? Do you know? I want to make sure I'm on the lookout for them. <laughs> Got some nugs on the way? Yeah, Kurt's like, he sent me this advertisement for these vegetarian nuggets. They're called nugs. And I was mm -hmm. like, yeah, I wanted to try those. I was looking at them a while back and I was like, I just never got around to try them. And he's like, you should get them. All right, I sent you some. <laughs> I was like, oh, all right then. I think you meant just like random delivery at this time of night, and I would be like, oh, that'd be weird for you. No, dude. Don't be weird. <clears throat> Tempo play. They still have five minutes to have a land. I never scoffed at your pepper jack. Pepper jack is a delicious cheese. You know what's not delicious? Putting it on meatballs. Wait, what? Oh, pepper jack. Okay. Can you imagine if we just... We have three looks if we can get a Splinter Twin. That's what just wins us. Okay, that's uh, not what Father likes. Don't have a Woodfall Pro... Well, we have two turns. We do have two turns. I would definitely keep the impulse. Yeah, I mean now our only plan is to combo because we're not going to win that race. So, oh boy, oh boy, oh my impulse God. time. Well, let's do it now. Yeah, I guess we could leave up Vencer. Okay, <coughs> so we get we get to look at like six cards, right? Four, the draw for the turn, the Jace. So six cards. Man, protection from everything is a hell of an ability. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Nugs haven't even shipped yet? That was like three days ago, man. What, are they taking their time? What, are they slow nugs? That's what nugs are for. That's fine. family okay that is true the nugs people are small time he's playing all these things but they can't be super that relevant they can't be that small time if they're mass producing a uh, a vegetarian chicken nugget you know what i mean because like that takes a lot of science and a lot of production oh, i thought that was it All right, this is our one shot. <laughs> Unless you have a way to gain a couple life. But he can just trample us, so it actually doesn't work. He can just use Garouk to trample us. So we're ultra mega dead, no matter what, unless we hit. Yep, and we're dead. But maybe, Michael. Maybe we're not dead yet. Hold on. Let's figure it out. Can we target this with... Uh... No. Okay. <laughs> The answer to all your questions is no. Progenitus is... The answer to all questions about progenitus is no. I want to go to the next I can make one. a flow chart for you. Someone's actually done that about progenitus. That's pretty hilarious, actually. Oh, man, I thought that was it. I thought it was all it. Oh, it was so close. Yeah, it was only four turns off. That's all I needed. God, progenitus is a real piece of shit. You're not playing Cryptic Command. Wow, that takes a lot of... Uh, Triple blue. Takes a lot of effort. I agree with you. It was not hard. It was not easy, rather. Also, they're way too fast for Cryptic anyway. I don't think it matters. 
deck does seem kind of bad here, though. Is there something better we could bring in? Not really. Cryptic Command. Yeah, I mean, on the off chance it's good, it'll be great. It also does buy it, you a turn for It uh, taps their board. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm going to keep this because uh, yeah, of, cause of Confluence. confluence yeah. Plus, we have Recruiter to get one and a half. One half. Oh, they mulled <clears> six <throat> again. Why can't you got a soul ring in this hand? No. Man, life is hard. <laughs> That's what Michael's for. <clears throat> you know what's the downside to playing Fallout? What's what's the downside? That you have no time whatsoever? That one. Two, uh, I always get inspired by other builds and then I want to make a new character because I'm like, oh, that's cool. I haven't done that yet. Where are you seeing them though? I'm just like looking at Fallout perks and like wondering what I could do and stuff. Oh my god, it's so funny that game has so much replayability. For like, you. I want to play a character with 11 charisma because apparently 11 charisma gets you, you will never fail a speech check. Well, yeah, because it's like higher than what's possible, what's naturally possible. Also, don't forget we got this house showing tomorrow between 12 and 1. You want to do that tomorrow? Yeah, well. Yeah. Okay, well, Sunday was also an option, so. Yeah, I want to just get that shit done as quick as possible. <clears throat> oh, yeah. That's actually real. Oh, my God. If they tap out to, to friggin' use this. Then they can't, yeah. Hopefully they go for, like, Nissa. That'd be great. That would be gas. Let's do it. Come on, buddy. And if they don't, we just get the impulse, so. <laughs> oh yeah, no way, bro. The good times. Let's have that on turn five it. instead. Thank you, Grimonolith. Okay, whatever. Would have taken a soul ring too. Took in, he would have taken a soul ring. I almost wish this was a trinket mage right now, so we can get. I think we just ring. play recruiter, right? Did he what though? So go get one of our halves. Our combo. We'll I was gonna play impulse to try to hit a land. We can do that on our turn if we need to. You know what? I'll listen to you because you seem smart. Plus, tapping a land from them can be super relevant. <coughs> the good times. Mm, that we don't really care about. See? Easy peasy. Was it, though? It's not the land we're looking for. I mean, you can impulse. What's that? I gotta play it in an instant. They're not really doing anything threatening to us, either. anyway. Hmm. Like impulse lets us dig for a land or other off combo. I'm just gonna pass here. Really? Yeah. I'll just play Deceiver Exarch, untap a land, impulse, and then we can start a hill like Splinter Twin Mountain. No, well, you can't take two cards from impulse. Right, but we have to draw cards naturally. I don't okay. know if you knew that. Every turn they let you draw one. Oh, we missed. We didn't play our land. Right. That's why I wanted you to impulse to try to hit a, a mountain. Like doing it in sorcery is just fine. Yeah, but you don't have to. Like we can just impulse because we need to play Deceiver Exarch, untap a land, and then play impulse with my plan. I just forgot to play the stupid land. Okay. Like why wouldn't I get the Deceiver Exarch on board for when we draw? That's that's so frustrating. Could just do it anyway and hope the Mize. Oh wait, we can't. We need two parts, not one. Never mind. I mean, if they attack, I'm actually probably going to deceive Rex Arc and double block, but they're apparently not doing that. Ulamog. <coughs> wow, I can't believe I missed the land. I, that's so stupid. Wow. Yeah, I was wondering what was going on. We do. Send them on down to Rat Train. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the Rat Train? <laughs> <laughs> Send them on 
down to Rat Train and then have you ever gone outside and what did you say? Give him a call on the Rat Train. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> what the fuck? I kind of like taking Venser here and then just bouncing like their tree speaker. It's not terrible. Or actually they're probably going to play one, two, three, four. They're probably going to play Nissa, right? So we'll just bounce the Nissa again. Yeah. Ugh. I'm really near mountain. Yeah, Michael. I'm aware. Our hand is full of gas, at least. Yeah, we just want to hit lands. Mike, you're going to follow a character that's just a big, dumb brute and name him Rat Train. <laughs> uh, I kind of did do that. My latest character before the one... I'm I'm going to... This time, I'm not going to delete a character. I'm going to save him for later to keep playing him. But um, I made a character called Guts, inspired off of the Berserk character, Guts. So he's just a big guy with like 10 intelligence he's or sorry 10 strength and 10 in turns so he just walks around and slaps Jesus things Christ. with a sword send him on down to the rat train I can make my new character rat train because he's going to be kind of sneaky so that's kind of rat like right Does this land have, like... Is the green, like, bleeding onto the border here? No, I don't think so. Are you insane? Oh, wait. Yes, yeah, I do see this that. This thin slice of brown sliver oh, yeah. on that side, and then right. on this side, it's all green. Huh. Weird. It's also green on the... No. Not on the bottom. No, now they're both, they're both green. Sure. Oh, my God. Just give me that friggin' red. I want fire your confluence, boy! Wow. <clears throat> so we can deal two. Too, we right? can deal two to everything and also kill their soul ring. Oh, that seems great. I mean, it's still good to play Anissa though if they have a land. Hmm. I can't even pick four modes: two to everything and two artifacts. Why are we time walking? Why not? We get an extra draw. Okay. Because if we hit a land, I'd rather play um, Consecrated Sphinx and then play Fire Confluence, which gets rid of like all their forests as well. Oh, that's a good point. I mean, we're just hoping their hand doesn't miss a Crater Hoof, I guess. Because then we can also just attack into the Nissa. Well, they wouldn't have enough mana to Nissa and Crater with this turn, I right. think. Oh, wow. Now we're talking. Man, during their upkeep, they take a damage and we draw two cards. Or during their draw step, I guess. Their deck's good. Or they could do with this turn, actually. Yeah. Although we wouldn't have enough... Well... Let's see, they would have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, they could just 10, search 11, for it 12, too. 13, 14, 15. But I guess they would only have like one, two, they would have two creatures. So. Yeah, so it would only be 5 plus 4, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It would only be 15 damage. Which is pretty hilarious considering it's only two creatures attacking, but... <clears throat> I guess they're going to go get it if they have it we'll have for to. next turn. Buddy, I'll cryptic command that shit so hard. <laughs> I'm just got a bird of paradise to block. Maybe. Man, I wish I wish fire compliments had four modes. I would go through to everything and destroy their soul ring. Can we just draw time walk? I feel like that'd be pretty cool. Walking ballista. Jesus. Mike B, you want some nugs? You mean those like vegetarian nugs? Walking ballista four. You got it. Well, 
Well, it does make it so fire confluence is a little awkward because he can kill our Sphinx. You can just bounce it. Does that do anything? I don't think so. <clears throat> we should do time walk. To make our life a lot easier. Man, time walk would be super cool, my dude. No real nugs? I don't hate the idea of nuggets. Wow. I'll never turn down a nug. If you're just going to block that, there's no reason to attack there, right? Oh, if he does block it, though, I guess we could get it with Fire Confluence. Maybe we could do it for two. He might block it. He has to, right, or else she dies. So actually attacking that's great, because then if they block it, we can do Fire Confluence for two and kill their Soul Ring. And it kills everything but their one forest guy. I'm actually tempted to Cryptic Command bounce the walking... I think they shoot the answer, though. Actually, yeah, I think that's correct because if they don't block it, we just get to kill this. Well, if they, if they they have to block it, and then they only get to, to shoot two things, otherwise the walking blister dies to state based effects. Right. So. And now they can only deal two to our, our bro. So we can confluence, and kill their board. It does leave them with a Nissa, but. Yeah, but then we have Consecrated Sphinx. I think we do nuke their board, right? Like They'll get access to 6, 7, 8, 9. No, they still have access to 10 mana, but Ulamog is in the graveyard, so I don't know what they could do. That would be that bad. And they'll have no creatures, so Cardi Reef isn't a threat. So kill this, 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 this. We're just dealing 3 to everything, right? Yeah. Plus, they only have one card left, so. Yep, take two. <coughs> a man who doesn't like nuggets is a man you can't trust. <laughs> uh, we could also upkeep, tap their cryptic, or tap their soul ring to cut them off from some mana. Or a forest, either one. It's like the same thing. Yeah, I like that. It also blocks their forest. Yes. I'll actually do it during the draw step because if they're not, yeah, all right, they're not going to untap that. All right, because you can get that instead. Gotcha. Well, because they could have, if they chose to do that, they could have just added mana. Might have been better to tap a forest there because of group, but. Well, they get to untap the forest, is my thinking. Oh, true. I mean, they still do, but... Yeah, then this is so nuts. It's very good. Ooh, a Harmonize. Okay. This is actually fine. So we get to kill Nissa, counter their Harmonize, bounce their Forest. Yeah, I feel like we've turned the corner, as uh, as they say. As the kids say. I've heard them say it. Do we have eight mana? Wow, that's like a million. What if I like chicken tendies instead? That's acceptable. I mean, chicken tendies are just big chicken nuggets, right? But they are higher quality meat usually. I give your mom some higher quality meat. Cool, man. <laughs> you can play Grim for free if you plus one. I don't think I care about that. I think I just want to get rid of one of these. Probably the the Oracle. Yeah, Oracle's more potential. It's more potential. So now we know they're drawing Harmonize. Okay, so they have nothing. Well, they have one card. <laughs> wow! Wow. Oh, wow, Jesus. Chris. I thought we were friends. I, I keep forgetting I'm drawing two cards every turn from their stupid, from our stupid guy. And that's just a lot. Yeah, I don't want them drawing three cards. Screw that, man. We could counter and bounce their forest. That's pretty brutal, right? I don't think I care about the forest, though. Like, it doesn't tap for two anymore. Yeah, and we have a 1-4 yeah. blocker. So just counter draw. 
Like, they're basically going to concede here. Or they should. Okay. It's a lot of mana. Okay. <laughs> I can just kill their forest, leaves them with four mana. And they're taking like one a turn. Where's this friggin' Splinter Twin? Didn't need it. Didn't need it. That's true. My relationships with your mother don't involve our friendship. Snap keep. Snapples, make keeples. <clears throat> yeah, it's pretty good. <clears throat> <clears throat> <laughs> on the play or the draw? We were on the draw, unfortunately. They multiply five, though? Jesus. They're dead. They might be. Hands thought very good. Sees. They didn't thought seize us. Pre counter counterspell, potential board wipe, two insane threats. A bouncy boy. I don't want another bouncy these. boy. I might want this guy actually. Yeah, I'd take an impulse. We kind of need a land, so. See, I mean, I, I, I tried remand, but it looked like you tried. I to tried mount. mountain rather, and it didn't let me do it. Oh, they're going on <laughs> down to rat train. They're sending us down. It's okay. We got confluence. Yeah. We can also bounce this rat with. Uh... Actually, I kind of want to do that. Now, why? Well, because if they make another rat, then then they just get a like in response to us bouncing it they could just make another rat and then they have a board right does that make sense but why what, they'll waste a turn yeah you're right we'll you're right it costs three them, instead right? of two and they discard a card I guess because we can always do it next turn if we really want to wow they're going on down to rat train send them on down to rat train on the rat train here yeah we do here. we do yeah. We might actually Set still want to do it because... Oh, I do. Train. I want to bounce this one. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the rat train? <laughs> <laughs> Send him on down to rat train. And then have you ever gone outside and... What did you say? Give him a call on the rat train. <laughs> Something like that. Dude, that's my favorite. That's my favorite meme of 2020. It's gonna have a lot of competition this year. Or it's got a, it's gonna there's a high bar for God, are you doing it again? Are you just making more rats forever? Going on making rats. Man, they're really committing to the rat trains. Okay, we got fiery. Go 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 gone blue and sins and sins. If we can't hit an impulse if we can't hit a land with impulse and draw, like we don't deserve it. Don't make the game angry. We did it. Oh, uh, look! You want to do it now? You want to You want to think they should waste another card? Yeah, why not? Should I play kindling? Yeah, sure. Might as well get them supreme, right? Get them supreme. What if they don't make another rat? Then mm. I feel stupid. Then you still get the block one. You get the block one anyway, right? Or is it a four three? It's a four three. Yes. Yeah, so if they don't make a rat, you get a free block. If they don't make a rat, you get a free block. Well, even if they make a rat, we get a free block because this guy comes back. Oh, chicken comes back. That's right. So this turn's actually pretty awkward for them. I'm trying to meme, but text only is rough. Hey, man, I hear you. Chris, you want me to Skype you in? Thank you. Mike's mom has got it going on. She's all I want and all I've waited for so long. Jesus. Mike, can you see? You're just not the guy for me. I know it might be wrong, but I'm in love with Mike's mom. Wow. Michael's mom has got <laughs> it going on. Lotus, huh? Midnight Me, thanks so much for the sub. Really appreciate it, buddy. Welcome, welcome. Now the only problem is... If we do it for two, they make a rat in response. So we have to do it for three. And if we don't, they go EOT rat, and then they could potentially make another rat and make them four fours. Well, we got a Venser. We're, We're just trying to get the, the most scratch? value as we can here. Scritching? Yeah, I'm scritching. 
I like Venser here because even if they try to do some bullshit Lotus shenanigans, we can we can right. bounce it. Michael's mom has got it going on. <laughs> They got rid of Toxic Deluge going on down to Deluge. Although if we don't vent her, we're going to take like a million damage too. So. No, we'll take nine. We'll vent her and then we'll block because it doesn't really matter. They sack that. Oh, God. So oh, that's fine because that dies anyway. Wow, this is great for us. Holy crap. I'm just taking nine here and then wiping the board and then getting my chicken back. Yeah, because they have no cards in hand so they can't make another rat. I'm oh, so no, they get the chicken though. Why do they get the chicken? Because the chicken dies, so they get the egg. So we don't get the chicken back. So I think I kind of want to venture and bounce the chicken. Bounce the chicken and block. <clears throat> Does the egg work like that? Yeah, because the egg would go to the, yeah they would get it because when it dies they get the trigger they get an O one. But when it dies, doesn't it go to our graveyard? Yes, the the bird goes to our graveyard. But then when their egg cracks and looks for a, a rekindling phoenix. It, it searches any graveyard? No, it searches their graveyard. I just want to read it. At the beginning of your upkeep, sack this creature and return a card named Rekindling Phoenix from your graveyard. From your graveyard? Yes. It won't be in their graveyard. So okay. they don't get a chicken. But we don't either. <laughs> like, oh, sure. We don't have an egg. It's a real chicken and egg situation, Michael. I just thought you meant they were, they were going to somehow get the chicken back. No, I just don't want them. I don't want to lose my chicken. Well, so why is your chicken grayed out? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Does it mean it's not in your hand anymore? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Oh, just, that was weird. Okay, chicken's back online. All right, chicken's back in the game. All right, we're just going to cast this and they have no cards in hand. And they're going to concede, is my guess, because they have no cards I in hand. I wish I had one more land five. so then I can go Chandra into Fiery Confluence. And I'm so glad rats don't work where you can just not have to discard a card and pay three. What? You thought it would just be like pay three and make a do? All right, then we won the game. It's like got a madness clause where you run your out of cards, you can still do it. Going on down to Rat Train. They went down to Rat Train. Also, my prediction came true. You rat their board and they concede. Wow. They didn't even have any threats. You're like a, you're like a pro, you're like a prophet. Bub. Bub. Little bub. bub. Little bub. Little bub passed away. It's very unfortunate. I was, I do, I, I cried a little bit. To be fair, there was a lot of stuff wrong with that cat, unfortunately. Like, you know, health wise. Well, yeah, but. There's a little bub, Michael. <laughs> just very sad. Just goddamn respect. Put some respect <laughs> on little bub's name, Michael. <laughs> she was a goddamn treasure. I always forget it was a she. It? Yeah. Jesus. Oh, wow. That's good. That's what Father likes. I mean, we're going to trigger her pretty soon with all of our sorceries and instants, but. Hey yuck, hey yuck, hey yuck. <clears throat> I don't like no <gasps> Okay. If they randomly tap out, they're just dead. Oh, we're doing or if it. they leave, leave leave one thing on tap. So if they play anything, they're just dead. God, I hope they didn't yeah, even it's charge such a that. Silly combo to have in your deck. They like... didn't even charge this. Oh, that's weird. Well, that's one less mana that they can have. Maybe they just bought oh, God. turn. They didn't buy themselves shit. They lost the game, Mugglebee. Yep. Game's over. You got it. X is three. Maybe they didn't lose. What are they going to oh, get them tangle, tangle wire? wire. That it's would be... Dece. Wait, doesn't tangle wire have a clause where if it's tapped it doesn't work? Nope. They got the oh, they're dead. They're dead. <laughs> they're dead. Oh boy, are they dead. I'll just untap my land because you know what? Who cares? Going on down to Rat Train. Watch him make me do it. Untap this guy. Always yield. You make me do it? In the Vintage Cube. Yeah, we only need me to make 19 copies. I guess so. <clears throat> Don't mess up. Ah, uh, so that's, that's, yeah, that's the concern, right? I guess I'll just take my time. Yeah, don't do it fast. I can't believe they're making me do this in Vintage Cube. Like, I think people do it when it's like a, uh, when it's like a grindy, constructed match. Plus, and... we're already up a game, so they can't actually win. Like, 
Like, if this was, uh, like, the second game and they won the first, I could kind of understand it. I'd try to run out our clock a little bit. But, like, I have 20 minutes, man. I don't know why you'd make someone do it at Vintage Cube. Like, it's supposed to be a fun format. It's, like, it's like the most fun, casual, like, nonsense format that you can do. Now we're going to make 40 just in case. All right, I'm going to move this over here to minimize my clickage. Man, what a min-maxer. <laughs> I want that value, man. I want that, that distance that value. value. Yeah. Well, time is money, so you're actually saving money in my theory. That's your theory? Yeah, I came up with it. Wow, that's impressive. So we have 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We might have 20. Oh, now, now they conceded. Okay, cool. Cool, I'm glad you got to... God, he he wanted it. you to get exactly 17 before you <laughs> He's like, I can see when they get to 17. Wow, we're killing this cube, man. Going on. I got some barbecue sauce in my shirt. I pulled a Mike B tonight. I, I got some, not on this shirt, but my other shirt, I got some sp spaghetti sauce on it. Hey, man, you want to get some chicken parmas tomorrow after the last week? Check out that house? Uh, Yeah, we should have time for that. Italian Mia? Yeah. Nice. Chicken parmas, boy. You know, I'm kind of keeping this hand. I'm feeling it. Nice, my snip is working. It is. Yeah, Chris donated 50 bits, and he was like, draft the good cards and win bits. And I was like, dang, it's a good strategy. Come Papa on. needs an island. What's the deets on this place you're looking at? Kurt, I'll send it to you. Going on down. I'm a little worried about the square footage, but we'll see how big the rooms are. Really? 1,076? Is that more or less than the, the second one we saw on that one day? I don't know, but 1,000, that's almost 1,100. That's a good amount. How much is in this place? 1,500. Hmm. Okay. What happened? Nifty Chris, speaking of which, give me that gold badge right meow. Do you, oh, wow. Dang. Chris is a gold badge son of a biscuit. I have to find. He passed. Did I? Yeah. Oh, there he is. Okay. Island. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, grimy. I really like to draw Island Island. I would like that. Or Island Splinter Twin. We have Splinter Twin. Why would you want no, to draw I mean, Island copy? to see Rex Ark. <laughs> Island to see Rex Ark. Like, we don't need another mountain. Oh, God. Ooh, that's scary. How about we just get Fiery Confluence? A three-color Rafaela's deck. Man, these people, they really are greedy. All right. Well, we got literal nothing to do here. <laughs> Inferno Titan would have been nice, but... Uh, you Is know. that in your deck? No. Okay. It just would have been nice. I joked with Thok that you were going to buy a house and clear out and rent to Frank and Mike. Oh, it's a, oh you're saying that's Kerwit. Oh. Kurt said, it's got a shiny floor. <laughs> it does have a shiny floor. Yeah, it looks nice from these picks. That's for sure. Yeah, it looks real nice. It's just a little small, but I don't care about that. Bathroom looks decent. No picks of the rooms, though. Jerks. I hate when they do that. I'm like, come on, man. Show us the rooms, man. Show, show me the rooms. Well, that's a good draw. Let's kill everything they have. You have just enough mana to do it. I only got one, one extra. Well, no, you have to pay one for... Well, yeah, so this is three, four, five. Oh. Yeah, for, uh, it, costs, it taps for three. That's oh. right. I guess they could have a counterspell. They did not. That feels good. Yeah. See you later, bitches. And Confluence impresses me so much. This card is unbelievable. Like, it kills artifacts, it kills creatures, and it just kills your opponent. It randomly nugs people for, for six. For six, yeah, yeah, it's ridiculous. Six is a lot. It is a lot. Four mana deal six, that's... That's better than a Lava Axe. Like, one attack with a... Uh, yeah, for one less mana and has two more modes. Yeah. It puts Lava to shame. They have nothing, Lebowski. Okay. Okay. Well, um, neither do we, I guess. And target this? Nope. Oh. Please don't. Okay. I guess I'll just pass that. Oh, we can untap our Grim model though. Oh, boy. <laughs> Look at all we can cast. Oh, I hate when they don't have dimensions of rooms. If you have dimensions on rooms, you'd save me so much friggin' time. Yeah. Like, if you were like, this room is 40 by 12, I'd be like, okay, that's pretty big. I'll take it. 
I'll take it. I mean, you're always going to go see it, though. You never... Well, that's place. true, but yeah. I'd know if I was wasting my time from the beginning. Oh, sure. You know what like, I mean? The rooms are five by five. I'm like, well... <clears throat> I hit my head when I lay down. It's an open house, right? We don't got to go get keys or nothing? No. So we can leave by, like, 11.30? Yeah. Okay, cool. I mean, we can probably leave later than that, because, like... <gasps> oh... Uh, I think we just mold drifter. I think here. we do mold drifter here. Deceiver X Dark. Oh, oh, island. Yes. God, it's so All right, now we're in the game. The game is back. Oh, they didn't. They didn't charge it either. Our last two opponents just don't charge Coalition Relic at the end. I of think the they're turn. just forgetting. Yeah, but that's weird. The two of them do it. You want know, some of this fan man? I thought it was just hogging it all. Okay. I'm at a good temp. Okay. Oh, we could we could twin on Muldrift. It's, it's like a build your own consecrated sphinx. I guess he wants to trade. What is this place? Oh god, it's terrible. It comes with all that already there. Kurt's like these people robbed a fast casual restaurant. I'm blocking. Yeah, I don't know why I wouldn't. Yeah, I have no desire to put... Oh, shit. They yeah, have three we... cards, though. I'm kind of tempted to wait for you until we can have Remand up. Yeah, why not? We don't really need to do anything. they got no pressure. I guess we can play Jace here. I do like that. How sweet yeah, if we do nothing, we get all CO2. Be loved by you. -doo 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 -doo. We also have Brazen Borrower in case they randomly play some monster... And we can bounce the boots so they don't kill us. I Why guess. don't we just bounce the monster in response to them equipping the boots? Well, it depends on what monster it is and well, what it abilities it has. If it's big, <clears throat> then I'll probably just bounce it. <clears throat> yeah, I remember when Chili's had all the tacky shit on the walls. Man, I totally forgot about that. I think they got rid of it because of the movie Office Space because they thought everyone was making fun of them. Well, they might have. Yeah, I mean, they, people were, right? Like, it kind of was. And that was clearly what that joke was all about. Are you going to take my Jace? Do we really care? I don't know what I do <coughs> anymore. I honestly think you just let it happen. Like, we can, like, impulse into Consecrated Sphinx. Yeah, it would have been after, right. It would have been after the movie, right. They They took all the shit off all the walls after the movie. Hmm. Like, they don't have anything in their graveyard that's sorcery based. They also can't flip it, so it doesn't matter. Like, right. if they yeah, flip it, we get it, it back. Get it back right. yeah, so, it, this Whatever. seems not great on their part. I guess they're just kind of low on gas. So they're just putting a 2 2 out there. They also overpaid for it because they had the they had the uh, thing. I guess they give one of them haste. Sure, I'll take two. I'll impulse. Yeah, well, they don't have to flip it. They can just take it to deny us resources, but... It's not great. I think they're just trying to put a body on the board. What? Put the body on Shut the up board. and take my money! Oh. Caspi done a dog. Happy birthday, Mike Barbabla Baloney. Barbabla <laughs> Baloney. That's his... That's the mother his name gave... That's the name his mother gave him. Shit, I said it backwards. Fuck. You totally did. I'm such an idiot. Obviously. All right, let's just draw Deceiver XR and call it a day, my dudes. I kind of like Chandra here. Yeah. I think Chandra is better than Preordain, so. I agree with you. And we don't need a land. <laughs> now we can just play Consecrated Sphinx and take an extra turn, so we still have mana. So we want four... How sweet. And then add the two with her. Yeah. Oh, we get to do it all. Oh my god. This is One, insane. Two, yeah, that's enough. 
I hope Please. you don't have Brutal. a counter spell, but if you do, if you do, it's not the end of the world. Not the end of the world, baby. Oh wow, that resolved. They kind of like sword or something. Yeah. yeah. You always gotta expect the worst. They did not swords it. I don't think they have it because why would they let us on tab? Why would they do it, Michael? Michael, why would they do it? <laughs> Michael, what are you laughing at? I think we bring in Ancient Grudge. When, oh, 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 ancient when, Grudge. Oh, oh, oh. What are they doing? Oh, nothing? Okay. Oh, yes. Oh, yes! Goosh! I'm gonna steal this coalition relic, my dude. Yo, I can have this. God, I feel surprisingly safe with both Rand and Brazen Barber in hand. How sweet it is to be Michael B. It's Michael B, babe. Wow, they didn't even tap it in response. What is happening? I don't know. I feel like our opponent is really, uh, how you say, dropping the ball. Oh, uh, David, we could try and do arcades this weekend. I have to find some time. I think I'll be streaming tomorrow at some point. Okay, we win. <laughs> he said we win, and he doesn't even know. This opponent could have counter spells all day. You didn't show us one for Consecrated Sphinx, so they probably don't have one, is my guess. Why not steal the boots? I just don't care about them. Like, if they had an answer for Consecrated Sphinx, they would have... Sure. Well, they're probably just going kind to of tap down my creature to kill, like, Dak, but I don't... Who cares? I, I don't think I do care. Dak's already done his job. Shut up and take my money! Dirty hippie... Hey, Michael, why are you no drink of the vodka? Because <laughs> I got to work tomorrow. Why, Michael? Michael, why are you no drink of the vodka? Why are you no drink of the vodka, huh? I don't even care about Dak anymore. Like, look at my hand. Nope. Don't care. I'm drawing two cards a turn from Consecrated Sphinx. I have an extra card a turn with Chandra. And I already stole your Coalition Relic. I don't care. Oh, I get this guy. That's pretty cool. Oh, wow. I get to draw two and I get my Jace back? Sure. I get to. I also get to Time Walk, just to be clear. <laughs> Deceivy boy. Tap this guy. Oh, we just won the game. Okay. They know what's going on. Jesus, what a bloodbath. I want to bring an Ancient Grudge, and we're going to bring in this guy instead of a mountain. Actually, Embreath Shieldbreaker probably comes in, too, over Thing in the Ice. Uh, no, Thing's pretty good, though, right? What does yeah. it How do? How spells do we have? No, not many. I don't think it's been good this whole time. One, two, three. Uh, yeah, it's all. Yeah, okay. Four, five. Well, we have five. we have a bunch of spells, but it's just you have to hit four of them, and I don't think it's that great. Also, I don't think we need to bring in Cryptic Command because they didn't really show us anything we need to counter. So I'm gonna cut something else. These are all our spells so far. <clears throat> yeah, so we have like nine spells. It's a lot, but make up Pyromancer. No, oh. Pyro? What? No, you stupid. That's okay, man. I know we we never really want to discard cards, right? He draws you cards whatever you discard. Oh, he does? Do you not know how Pyromancer works? Oh, that was discard two, get two guys. And you discard two. For every non-land you discard, you draw a card. Hmm. So if you discard, like... But if you have the extra lands, you get two guys. I mean, you get guys no matter what. Right. Okay. This hand's also great. I agree. A little slow, Shut up but... and take my money! Oh, birthday boy should be drinking the vodka. What's, what the, what's the vodka? What's the... What's going on right now? Did you make a vodka joke? No, but I did do that Tito's drunk stream that one time. Yeah, but that was like that was a while back. Ain't no while back. Ain't no while back. Man, I can't wait to have one day off. It's gonna be rad. Pretty much anyone is good for me. You can't wait. I can't you wait to have my one day off. It's gonna be super rad. That sounds rad, dude. That sounds super cool. Get that Caesar salad. What? Mom, well, I'm going to go over to do a gift exchange. My mom said she'd make me Caesar salad. The one day you have off? Yeah. Our friendship is suffering, man. I'm, just gonna, I'm not going to stay long. We're just going to gift exchange. And Bullshit. Eat. 
Understand. She's gonna be like, Michael, I want you to go online and spend this hundred dollars right now, and he's gonna she's gonna watch you do it. <laughs> you must do it. Spend it now. Do it now. <laughs> yeah, they also didn't wait. They could just wait until I showed the twin. Like they don't even know they have it, right? They were just like, you know what? I believe you. Give me something to play this turn. Okay. I appreciate it. Give me something to play. Give me a play. I guess we're just passing here. With Impulse and Jace Activation. Shut up and take my money. Can you wear shirt hands? <laughs> oh, wow. This is an old meme. Oh, God. Oh, going on down to Rat Train. Dan's, what's going on? You didn't even say you were here, buddy. You think myself, you think myself. Now I have that song stuck in my head. Thanks a lot, Dan's. If that is your real name. I actually just saw the pepper hat today. It was in a it's in a box under my bed. Going on down to pepper hat. So we're just gonna discard an island here if we have to. Uh we just boarded in the duel because we boarded an ancient grudge. Which we're gonna hit right now. Oh, it wasn't an ancient grudge. Going on down the red train. Time walk. Seems good. Seems better than a remand, right? Yeah. Just by a little bit. Hmm. You can just Shandy here. I could, but then it's going to take two. I guess I could Shandy and kill the Trigon Predator. Yeah, that seems good. I don't have a counter spell. What? And then next time we get to go Dak, Time Walk, Chandra, Chandra, Dak, Dak. Four Planeswalker activations and a Time Walk. Seems good. You kick my mock, but you dig mock, but he's face. Oh man, you're going to kill yourself. Do you want to do a stream next week sometime where we cut each other's faces off and wear each other's faces? Oh, face off stream? Yeah. Yeah, sure. All right, so do you want to use do you want to use the knife, an exacto knife, or we can get some razor blades from the bathroom? I think the exacto knife will work. Best. Yeah, I think so too. I think you can get more precision with it. Yeah, it's a surgical tool. Oh, no channel. That's scary. I see. Well, hope we're not dead. A lot of people play channel and they just like do some dirtily shit. They're like, I'll play a uh, Pelucranos. I'll play a Coalition Relic. Why do you have a knife? Why? I mean, why not? Knife is a, a useful utility object. I don't think we're dead. They only paid four life. They're just playing Hydroid Crap. No, they can't. Yeah, they can. What the fuck? That is <laughs> That's barely worth it. At your computer? Yeah, because all my stuff's on my computer. My watch is on my computer. My... I mean, it's at my desk. Like, it's at my, it's on my desk where I keep things. You're crazy, man. I know. Things on your desk. I mean, my, my glasses are on my desk. Like, my everyday carry stuff is on my desk. My keys, my watch, my phone. Yeah, like, I do the same, so. Right, like. It seems pretty well. Normal, not on right? your desk, on my desk. Yeah, that's weird. If Mike comes in my room every day and he's like, "Hey, man, I need my stuff." Sorry, I keep it on your desk. <laughs> what the hell? Did they just treasure cruise? They used the channel to treasure cruise. I that's guess that's desperate. one way of doing it. That is desperate. Our hand is friggin' stacked. Oh, they're doing. It. Oh, they got more. Here, more, more is coming. All right, let's get ready. Get ready. I don't think they have enough life left, Emrakul, so I think we're fine. No, they don't. They're only like four. Well, no, they do, because they were at 14, and this would be 16 mana total, so they can go to one and play an Emrakul. But, uh... 
<laughs> like if you crashed your computer into a lake and you couldn't get your computer seatbelt off, now you have a knife to cut your way out. That's actually why I have it, yeah. But I also like open packages at my desk. I open like letters and stuff, so it's nice to have something sharp like. It's not like a kitchen knife. Like it's a nice like it's a nice like it's a nice knife. Like it's just a Oh. Well, that's fascinating. Why did it take so long to do that? I don't know. I wonder. I wonder what they'll get. I don't know. It's only green shit, though. They don't so. have haste, though, so... At least there's that. I guess there's that. They're also at seven. Wait, we can just kill them with Fire Compliment Chandra next turn. <laughs> they're, just, they're just dead. We do two to them? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, if we hit with this, right? Like... But no, if, no, if you we, just if you just you just don't cast it and you get the trigger, right? Oh, you're right. You could choose. You can choose, yeah. Oh no, now we can't. No, oh, because they're killing. That's Chandra, unfortunate. Yeah. Wow. Well, that's too bad. They always have to have it, I guess. How can you deal them one more damage? That's one off the combo. Confluence doesn't seem relevant here now. See an artifact? Hmm. No. Confluence definitely seems relevant. They're at seven. We have to deal one point. How are we going to do that, though? I don't know, but we can figure it out. So what do you get rid of? Dak. I don't think Dak does anything here. I mean, he digs us too deeper. I don't think we have time to dig too deeper, my dude. That's all we need to do, though, is we just need to find our other half of the combo. Like, we get a time walked and Dak. You know what else we can do, Michael? Digs a lot of cards deeper. We still have to flip Jace this way, though. Yep. So we get more turnies. Oh, Career Dan's good. That, like is, that. that is good. We're going to get a shieldy boy. <laughs> oh, wow. That's interesting. I want both of these. So we can actually play Grim Monolith and... We only get to draw one of them. We get to draw both of them over time because we're time walking. <laughs> right. What does the Grim Monarch really do for us, though? It gives us more mana, so we can Fiery Confluence, Flashback, Time Walk. No, we can Time Warp next turn. Wait, can't we... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. I want to set up a way to where we can Fiery Confluence twice. That's That's what I want to do, too. We didn't need eight mana for that. We would need four red, though, is the problem. We don't have enough red for it. And we're definitely dead to their attack, so. I'm pretty sure we just play Grim Monolith and Time Walk here. If we play Grim Monolith and Time Walk, next turn we get to untap with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 mana. Which means we get to Fiery Confluence. We only have two red. That's also we can't a... let them attack with the. Uh, no, no, we, <clears throat> no, we cannot. The Olamog though is a problem. Maybe we don't care about Grimmel. I don't know. Yeah, I think we don't care about Grimmel. Like we're restricted on the red mana. We have the... no time to flashback Confluence. Like we can, we can't give them another turn. If we do, we're just dead. Unless we draw the Sea or to tap their. I mean, it's only Annihilator, Annihilator 4. <laughs> yeah, that's Four, five, all of our lands. Six. No, it's not. We have six lands. We have five what lands. We're going to do two mana to win the game. We're just dead to that. Not to mention we're dead to... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, hold on. I shouldn't have taken an extra turn. Okay, so we get one more turn. I think this is it. We take another turn, yeah. And then we can take another turn with time warp. So many turns. Okay. So we have one, two. We have two extra turns. Jace goes up. Fiery Confluence. Uh, cast. One, two, three, four. Oh, wait. Do we... Yeah, we get another turn. We yeah. can flash okay. it back. Yeah, oof, that was close. Yeah, well, all we needed was a time walk, actually. Uh, 
You take my self, you take my self control. We figured it out. Woo! That was a hell of a match. I mean, we won, but, you know, still good for them, you know. Let's open this treasure chest like we do. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on patreon.com slash frankrapport. Twitch TV slash frankrapport. Coolstuffinc.com. Manitraders.com. Both those links and promo codes are in the description. Ageless Entity and 15 shit points. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.